Hello friends, welcome to Nandkishore classes. Today we are going to learn how to find LCM by prime factorization method. Let us try to find LCM of three numbers 4, 6 and 8. We are starting from simple number. We will move to difficult values as well. First of all, we should understand what is prime factorization. Prime factorization means expressing a number into product of its primes. For example, 4. Firstly, express 4 into product of primes, like 4 can be written as 2 times 2. Right? This is prime factorization of 4 we have done. 6. 6 can be expressed as 2 times 3. And 8 can be expressed as 2 times 2 times 2. This is what firstly we need to do expressing all the numbers into product of its primes. Now, how to write LCM looking at these prime factorizations? Please have a look very carefully and try to understand it. Let's suppose you are checking the first factorization which contains 2. Okay. Count how many times 2 is coming here. 2 is coming here 2 times. In the next number 2 is coming 1 time. And in the last number 2 is coming 3 times. 2 times, 1 time and 3 times. Take the highest count. Highest count is 3. So you will write 2, 3 times here. This is the first step. First thing we need to do. We are not going to leave any number. Now I checked all the numbers. I am getting 3 also somewhere. But 3 is coming only in one factorization that is of 6. And it is coming one time. But still I will write it. Even though it is not coming in other values, still I need to write it. Just multiply them. You will get 24. That means LCM of 4, 6 and 8 is 24. We will do more examples and concept will be clear. Don't worry. Please check the one more example I am going to take. Let's suppose we need to take LCM of 8, 12 and 16. What we need to do here? We first need to write prime factorizations of each number. Like for 8, it is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Sorry, it is 2 times 2 times 2 only. This is what we need to write. And 12. For 12, it is 2 times 2 times 3. So this is what we have for 12. And for 16, 2 will be written 4 times. Right? So firstly, prime factorization is done. It is similar type of question I have taken so that you can judge your answer yourself now. If we want to write LCM, what will be LCM here? Check for 2 first of all. 2 is coming 3 times. 2 is coming 2 times. Then 2 is coming 4 times. What is the highest number? 4 times is the highest number. So write 2 4 times. 3 is coming only once. Still I will need to write 3. If you multiply all of them, you will get 48. That means LCM of 8, 12 and 16 is 48. I hope you are able to understand the concept. And this rule can be used for any big numbers as well. Let us take few more examples. I am going to take big number now. Bigger than these. Not very big but bigger than these. So that concept is clear. Let us have a look. Now let's suppose we are taking an example of 12, 18 and 24. Let's suppose we want to find LCM of 12, 18 and 24. What will we do? Firstly do prime factorization of 12 which is 2 times 2 times 3, 18. It is 2 times 3 times 3 and for 24, 
टू मल्टीप्लाई टू मल्टीप्लाई टू अगेन मल्टीप्लाई थ्री दिस इज वट द प्राइम फैक्टेशन ऑफ ट्वेल्व एटीन एंड ट्वेंटी फोर इज नाउ लेट एस ट्राई टू फाइंड आउट इट्स एल सी एम इट्स एल सी एम इज फर्स्टली टू इज कमिंग हेयर टू टाइम्स टू इज कमिंग हेयर वन टाइम एंड इन द लास्ट वन टू इज कमिंग थ्री टाइम्स वट इज दाइएस्ट काउंट हाइएस्ट काउंट इज थ्री टाइम्स सो राइट टू थ्री टाइम्स हेयर नाउ चेक फॉर थ्री थ्री इज कमिंग इन ट्वेल्व एज वन काउंट इन एटीन टू काउंटिंग इज देयर इन ट्वेंटी फोर थ्री इज कमिंग वंस सो हाइएस्ट इज टू टाइम्स सो लेट एस राइट थ्री टू टाइम्स हेयर so what is the answer 2 times 2 times 2 is 8 3 times 3 is 9 8 times 9 is 72 that means lcm of 12 18 and 24 is 72 i hope you are clear with the method of finding prime factorization for the very big numbers also same concept will be used i am going to take few examples now let's suppose we are having a number 2 times 3 times 3 times 5 i am just taking only prime factorizations to make you understand how to select the lcm let's suppose another number is 2 times 2 times 3 times 7 and third factorization is 2 times 3 times 5 ek aur 5 le lete hain ye dekh now if you want to find lcm here what will you do check for 2 it is coming once it is coming two times it is coming once so i am going to take highest times that is 2 times 2 for 3 3 is coming two times here once here once here i need to take highest number of times so i am taking 3 also two times continuing further i checked 5 is coming once here 5 is coming two times here so i'll take 5 also two times and then 7 7 is coming only once so i'll write 7 here let me repeat you just need to check first of all we are not going to miss any number all the numbers will be written in the lcm the only thing is whichever is coming highest number of times that count we need to consider like 2 was coming once two times and one time i took two times two three was coming two times here in the first row then single time again single time i took two times five was coming once in the first even five is not coming in the second row still i am taking it and i am taking it two times because it is coming twice in the last one see seven is not coming anywhere else even though it is coming once i am writing here so we need not to leave any number every number will be written and that is how i can find the lcm just after doing its multiplication you will get the answer please do multiply and tell your answer in the comment box thank you so much